playing, or is this a good week to have off? It was definitely a good week. I think a lot of guys just were kind of banged up a little bit, bruised up, you know, normal football stuff. So getting that getting that uh, bye week and getting rested up is good for us. Besides the injury kind of stuff, is it, do you get to reflect on you guys a little bit more, maybe kind of self-scout a little bit more? Yeah, definitely. I think a bye week is mostly used for kind of reflecting on where we are as a team and focusing on what we can do better throughout the bye week. It's definitely what we did. From an offensive line standpoint, where do you guys feel like you're at coming into this next week? I think we're a lot closer to being where we want to be as an offensive line, doing the things that we want to do, and this is just a continu- this week is a continuation of uh, what we've been doing the last five or six weeks. What are the challenges of going up against the primary 30 front this week? Um, I guess there's no glaring differences, just that there's three down linemen and four linebackers, so it changes the scheme a little bit, but... Um, we're going to block five guys just like we always do. Is that a mental thing mostly because they can come from any direction, they can drop from any direction, more, more so than a traditional 4-3? Three, three. Um, I don't know. I think uh, that's, that's kind of a tough question. Um, it's not really any different in terms of you know our technique fundamentals, but I suppose the blocking schemes and the, um, and the assignments change just a little bit. That's, that's probably the biggest difference. Hmm. The plan uh, play both seniors.